Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the second round of this Professional League's first tournament. Alright, since we had an odd number of people join after the first rounds, instead of just giving someone a buy or made them not have a chance to battle, I decided I would just jump in as kind of a test to see if they were good enough to go into the finals. Sort of. So, I use primarily it's a UU team besides Tornadus, which is the only OU Pokemon I have. This is the team I use to test beginners OU teams to see how good they are. <clears throat> so, let's get right into this. this is today I'm battling Matt in round two for a chance to go to the finals. See, and this is where the plays get a little questionable for my opponent. Instead of swapping out into a bulkier Mon, especially defensive, he just uh, stays in and lets his Ferrothorn goes down, which ends up biting him in the butt later on when he needs a physical wall to help him. Because he's got a Gudra, and all Gudras basically are salt vested, specially defensive tanks. And that really would have helped, and Gudra had coverage for my Galvantula. So, and this is also, swapping into this was also a misplay on his part. Because it's not going to like this Thunder very much. Just gonna go ahead and set up the sticky web because I'm sashed and I'm gonna have another turn no matter what happens. And who knows, sticky web can be very helpful. I misclicked here and went for energy ball, and uh, it's not not really like it mattered very much. But it happens. Now, I used to run Mega Low Pony to test teams, but um, it's actually really, really a rough Pokemon to go against. It's so fast and hits so hard. It's just very, very rough. Another thing with this battle is, like, I didn't try to play my best. Like, I could have went for, you know, swapped into another Pokemon and went for a different move. But the whole point of this battle was to just to test his team, see how he worked with, like, an obstacle presented to him. And, um... So I didn't play my best. I didn't try to play my best. I made obviously bad. I made some obvious bad plays. Like you'll see later on. I I didn't I didn't try to crush him. Was the goal here? I was just trying to put up, see how good he was 
in every situation here. So, Smegaladios is not going to want to take a knockoff. But the Draco Meteor misses. And that would have easily destroyed me. So, uh, that's, that's just part of the game. But it's still pretty rough that that first miss happened at all. That's just Drapion. <laughs> it just does so much damage. Megalodios is a beast. It hits so hard. Like here, for example, I carried Ice Beam. I just kind of wanted to see what kind of place he would make to try to come back from this. Because he was at a pretty serious deficit, you know? And you know, two side shocks, my Vaporeon is not defensive at all, you know. So that takes him down, so I send in my Tornadus, and my Tornadus is pretty awesome. I love this Pokemon. I probably was gonna incorporate it into my proper OU team. I don't think that crit mattered at all, really. <clears throat> and that's a win for me. Um Like I said, it it did get down to 1-0, but the whole purpose of this wasn't for me to beat him badly. It was just to see where he was at skill-wise compared to some of the other people in the tournament. So this is the only battle I actually played in for the whole tournament, and it knocked out my good buddy Matt. And that's sad, but I already gave him pointers on stuff he could have done slightly differently to improve himself. and. You know, his team wasn't completely OU either. You know, it's very, very balanced team. Like, his physical attackers hit hard. His special attackers hit hard. His walls were good. It just misplayed a little bit. So, I mean, if you guys want to join tournaments or giveaways, all, the sorts, all sorts of stuff that we're always doing on the page, just check the link in the description. Come join us. We look forward to having you guys. All right, guys. See you later.